Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome to my channel. In today's in this video, I'm gonna show you how to boost FPS, fix FPS drops and lag in Wuthering Wave on your any Doen PC or laptop in 2024. Because in this video, I'm gonna show you step by step guide how to boost FPS in Wuthering Wave on your any PC. So guys, make sure to follow this whole guide and without wasting any time, let's dive straight into it. So guys, in the very first step, we are going to refresh our Windows file. So for that, we go for your Windows search, search for temp, and you will find that the delete temporary files in your system settings. Open up temporary files, there you will find that old installed app, videos, other than document, and there you will find the temporary file. So guys, open up this temporary file that is around 6.6.1 GB of the data. So guys go inside this folder now here you will find the download recycle bean simply leave the download folder because this must have some important download files on your pc so so skip this first folder and check mark on all the other boxes that include your recycle bean thumbnail microsoft defender antivirus files temporary files direct text shatter cache temporary internet file and delivery optimization file so once you select all it now click on the remove file button hit continue and remove and refresh your windows file now the next step we are going to optimize full screen optimization for our rootering game so for that you need to open up your file explorer go for your local disk c or the drive and install rootering wave on your pc now open up program file if you have installed it using the epic games so go for epic games folder now there you will find that rootering wave folder open up this folder inside you will find out here all these files and scroll all the way down and there you will find out this kind of launcher file for this game so guys you need to go into the properties of your this file so go for properties now go for compatibility check mark on disable full screen optimization now go for change high dps settings and also check mark on override high dps scaling behavior now hit ok click ok hit ok again and close out this window now in the next step we are going to optimize the graphic settings of your windows especially for the bothering games so simply right click on your desktop open up display settings of your windows now scroll all the way down and there you will find out related settings under there you will find out your graphic settings so go inside it now you need to go for default settings click on change default graphic settings turn on all these options from here now you need to go back now you need to go for browse option now again open up this pc the called C, program file epic games bothering waves now scroll down and select out here this launcher file hit add now go for option and set it on highest performance of your gpu now hit save and close out this window now in the next step you need to download the Wuthering game optimization pack on your pc you can find out the link in the description inside you will find all these files for the optimization of your pc that is process lasso gpu thread optimization and best week by major geek so guys open up process lasso application on your pc simply double tap here hit yes hit ok click i agree click next and install the software on your pc after installation here you will find our discount interface of the process lasso now in the very first step you need to go for this main option now check mark on manage processes for all users for having the full access of the process lasso on your overall pc now you need to go for active power profile and set it on high performance because i have already made and tested the ultimate performance with some performance and high performance on my pc and in my opinion high performance will work best for gaming so guys go for high performance and now you need to go for pro balance enable make sure to uncheck this box uncheck smart trim enable and uncheck the ideal saver and also uncheck performance mode on your pc in process lasso now once you follow the settings now in the next step you need to run the woodring game in your background once it is running in your background you need to go for the launcher or exe file of the woodring wave game and right click here go for cpu purity go for always and set it on real time for having the highest performance out of your pc simply hit yes and guys that's it now again right click here go for cpu affinity go for always set it on none after that check mark on all the cpu threads now i need to go back for input and output priority for reducing the input delay now go for always and simply set it on high for having the lowest amount of input delay out of your mouse and keyboard in withering wave now the next step go for power profile and set it on high performance now in the next step you need to go for this more option and there you will find out hard throttle so go for it go for always and set it on no throttle after that again right click here now this time again open up more option go for disable ideal saver and disable this option on your pc so once you follow all this step in the process layer, so now simply click on the close button and this application will keep running in your background whenever you turn your pc and help you to optimizing your pc 
Now the next step, open up GPU thread optimization folder and inside you will find .amd thread priority, Intel thread priority and Nvidia thread priority. Now you can use it according to your GPU if you have AMD, Intel or Nvidia. I have Nvidia so I will go with Nvidia thread priority, hit yes, hit yes again, click ok and close out this folder. Now the next step here you will find that all the important windows tweak. So open up best tweaks by major geeks and inside you will find that all these tweaks like advertisement and sponsor app advertisement id automatic maintenance in windows 10 or 11 deleting pending windows update deleting stub bone folder feature or suggested app on your windows game bar game mode and also a lot of settings for optimization of your windows so open up this first folder inside you will find out windows and disable most of ad so double tap here it is, it is again, click OK and this will disable all the advertisement on your windows. Now you need to go back and go for advertisement ID. Here you will find a disable advertisement ID for relevant ad and enable advertisement ID for relevant ad. So go for disable advertisement ID, it is, it is again and click OK and disable the advertising on your windows. Now go back, go for automatic maintenance and disable automatic maintenance on your windows because this is running in your background and you use a lot of your window resources so therefore disable it now here you will find our delete panning folder simply delete it from your pc now go for delete 7 folder also delete all the 7 folders go for feature or suggested app and disable automatically installing app on the windows because that also use your disk space and also your cpu and ram in the background now go for game bar and make sure to turn off the xbox game bar I go for game mode, turn off the game mode on your Windows 10 or 11. Go for game recording or broadcasting, disable this feature on your PC. Now go for get even more out of your Windows. And guys, enable this option on your PC. Go to the button app here, hit yes. And install this registry on your PC. Now go back. Go for hardware accelerated GPU scheduling. We have already enabled the settings. So guys, again, go for this option and enable the GPU scheduling on your PC for having the lower input delay and better performance. Now go for optimization for windows game and guys enable the settings on your pc hit ok now in the last you will find out windows update history clear go for it and clear all the uh, previous windows update history it has this will disable some services on your windows and guys that's it now close out this folder now in the next step we are going to disable all the useless windows service from our pc so for that go for your windows search search for service and you'll find your services make sure you run this as administrator for having the full access after that press w from your keyboard and find out this valid service i'm not using any valid service on my windows so you need to go into the properties Go for startup type and disable this feature from your pc now hit apply and click ok now and scroll all the way down there you will find that xbox accessory management xbox live auth manager xbox live game save and xbox live networking service make sure to go for all the properties and disable all the settings on your pc after that close out your windows services now in the final and the last step of this video we are going to disable the background apps and power throttling on our windows so for the press windows r together from your keyboard and simply type here gpedit.msc and press enter if you not find it here now you need to go for your window search search for local policy editor and press enter and this will open up the same exact window also on your pc now you need to go for computer configuration administrative template windows component app privacy scroll all the way down and there you will find out let's window app run in the background so go for it make sure to enable the settings after that go for default for all app and set it on force deny for disabling all the background running application hit apply and click ok now you need to go back now open up system settings now scroll all the way down and find out power management folder so go inside it now you need to go for power throttling settings turn off power throttling and enable the settings on your pc for disabling the power throttling or turning off the power throttling on the windows 10 or 11. I hit apply click ok close out it and now you need to one time reach your pc there for all the changes to take effect after that launch your game and enjoy the best performance out of your pc or laptop so if this video helped you so please make sure to drop a like on this video share your opinion about this video in the comment section and see you again in the next video